Greetings world, it is I, Andrew, the bearded lady from the Hairy Game Lords, and for Zatu Games I am reviewing for you Top of the Pops, the party game from Big Potato Games. What did I think? Find out. Let's just quickly go over to the table and see how easy it is. What you need is a clear surface for you to place down the board, your team kazoos, the head-to-head -head cards, and all of the other cards, as well as the buzzer. And you are good to go. As in any big potato game, this is super easy to play. Two people are selected, one from each. The buzzer is placed in the middle. A head-to-head -head card is read out. Songs containing the word house. First person to shout out a song involving the word house hits the button. 15 seconds is given for the other player to find a song and press the button. This goes back and forth and back and forth until somebody cannot think of a song containing the word house and the time runs out. The winner of the head-to-head -head picks out nine of these cards, like so. They then flip them over, have a look secretly at who is on these cards, picks three and hands the other six to the other side. The other player involved in the head-to-head -head picks three and then chucks the other three. You need to place uh, the cards face down into these sections here. One word, lyrics, and the kazoo. Simple as that. On the turn, you get 30 seconds when you press this. You have to describe this with, guess what, one word. This one, you have to give the lyrics, whether correct or not, sung or said. And this one, play the tune on the kazoo. Alternatively, if you want to hum or whistle, you can do so. Play goes back and forth. As soon as one team has all eight of these different cards, they win the game. Easy. Okay, so what did I think? Well, if you haven't seen so already, head over and check out our playthrough of this game when I and my fellow bearded brothers, the Hairy Game Lords, took one evening and played this fantastic, and that's what it is, a fantastic party game. If you have seen Blockbuster, it's effectively a reskin of that, but based around pop. And as I sat down to the table, I realised very quickly that I know films a lot better than I know music. Needless to say, this game still shone was still a lot of fun and huge amounts of banter was had around the table. Whether at my expense or others because we didn't know the song, we sang the wrong lyrics, hummed the wrong tune, whatever it may be, it was a lot of fun. Big Potato have produced what is a really good game here. The little board has a, a, that great kind of cassette player look. The card quality of those cassette tape cards is really good quality and you get a kazoo the only instrument that I can play and actually play pretty well see the playthrough the head-to-head -head was brilliant and so tricky trying to think of a song with the word love in it right now I could tell you loads at some point I could tell you loads but when that timer is ticking away when all of your friends around the table are humming at you in crazy ways trying to convey to you the name of the song or the the lyrics your mind just goes blank fun but also annoying but also fun but also you just see what i mean it's it's good laugh 
Then the whole thing with the board and uh, you, you, you choosing from the cards. Now what's great is in Blockbuster... Uh, there was only six cards, so three for one team, three for another. In this game, there are nine cards that are chosen at, at first. So you have more of a variety to choose from, even when you are the second player looking through the cards. This way, uh, it does stop, or is meant to stop, uh, you from not having a clue at all uh, about what is on your card. Again... See how Dave the Grey got on uh, in regards to that on the playthrough. Really like the idea of you being able to sing or say song lyrics, whether they are right or wrong. And love that kazoo, that name that tune element to the game. Not much more can be said about this game, except it's a lot of fun and one that you need to have a go on. So, obviously, it's available on Zatu Games, so why not? Head over to the store now and get involved. Thanks for watching. Laters.